Swing champion Lisa Curry sparked a lot of discussion this week when she told a current affair that she blames a condition called rushing woman syndrome for her relationship breakdown with Iron Man Grant Kenny. Take a look. To him, I was just being an absolute bitch, a cow, um, angry and irritable for no reason. He actually didn't do anything wrong. Um, but I just couldn't control it. The rushing woman syndrome is absolutely me. Um, it's been me for a, a long time. I didn't want to seem like I was the only cow on earth, but um, it was felt like that to me. Yeah, it's something we can all relate to, but what exactly is rushing woman syndrome? Is it a real medical condition that can be treated? Family counsellor and therapist Karen Phillip has the answers for us this morning. Good morning to you. Good morning. I'd never heard of this rushing woman syndrome before this interview, had you? No, I, I don't think any of us have. Look, it's not a syndrome. A syndrome is a genetic condition that you don't have control over. This is adrenaline burnout. This is exactly what it is. And anyone's adrenal glands will become burned out if we have a high-pressured life, if we rush around like crazy, if we have poor nutrition, so the difference between male and female, though, is because we women need progesterone. It's a bit like an anti-anxiety agent for us. And when our adrenals are burnt out, the progesterone production is reduced. So that will give us the result of being a little bit more emotional. But um, no, rushing women syndrome is debatable. So what are some of the warning signs of, of this, not condition, but <laughs> this thing? Yeah, the, the adrenals being burnt out. Uh, the, there's a number of conditions. Fatigue is the big one, that we just become very fatigued even if we've had a good sleep at night. We become emotionally overwhelmed, um, so we're unable to handle things and we can get cranky and agitated, but anyone can. Mm. It's not just a woman's condition, although women do these days tend to take on way too much. Uh, we are in charge of our own lives and diaries to a degree, yep. so it's a matter of taking time, slowing down, delegating some of the jobs, cutting out a lot of caffeine from our diet, which is also an, an adrenaline um, burnout, and then adding really good nutrition to our diet. That's the big thing. Herbs, of course, can be great, and hormone balancing herbs can be very good. However, it's more to do with time management and nutrition. Because Lisa Curry said that she had days when she felt completely out of control and that she wanted to kill the world, and she says this natural hormone treatment helped her get back on track. Do you think that is the right approach, to seek out specific treatment in that regard? Well, I mean, look, anything, anything like that will help us. There's no doubt about that. But it's great to take a whole heap of great hormones, I uh, beg your pardon, um, herbs. However, if we're going to continue to rush around, if we're going to continue to drink coffee, mm. eat poorly, eat junk food, then it's not going to make much difference at all. Yeah, because you could argue it's part of our modern life, really. And it, it is. is a bit worrying that this holistic nutrition specialist claiming that she can treat this condition wants to charge people $600 for the pleasure. Yeah, um, that's a little excessive. You could probably go to your health food store and get some good balancing uh, herbs and vitamins. But again, it all comes down to reducing the lifestyle, the stress in your lifestyle, the amount of work you're doing, add a lot better food to your diet and take care of yourself. And effectively, if you've got concerns, I suppose as the first port of call, go, go to your, to your GP. doctor. Absolutely, yeah. yes. All right, well, it certainly sparked a lot of debate. It has. Good on you, Karen. Thank you for coming in. And it really is a, a response that we want to hear from you too, whether or not you think you might be suffering from rushing women's syndrome or not. Send us in your response to Twitter, Facebook or email. Can. And the news is chilling.